shit's stinky. Been on the road for a while. What's your best training tip for a young shredder who wants to be an Olympian like you? <laughs> best training tip. Um, I think there's a lot of elements that go into that, but uh, uh, you know, I think I think the most important thing that I've learned and I had to relearn from when I was traveling around the world with Toro when I was 12 and 13 years old and then through my teenage years to now is that you can never lose the love and passion for going out there every day and doing it for the right reasons because there's no other reason and obviously you got to have aspirations you got to work hard and do all those things but um, that's probably the biggest one That is so weird. Why won't these play during you want to go to? Them? But you obviously haven't earned it in your head yet. Yeah. So just do fives until you're bored, and then one is going to be a nine. It's not there. That's in the shoulder. It's like that. Okay. Because what you're doing when you're going out, I watched twice now. You're doing your chin to shoulder, which is great because you're doing what you're saying you're going to do. But you're fully disconnecting your legs from your body. Especially backside. Yeah. One motion. And just a quiet motion. The fives you were doing were that. Yeah, because as soon as I go past five, I feel like I then am like... Disconnected. Old habit. Try that. I'll try and do some... Do some fives, but like, and as well, what you're doing when you go up. Are you getting that? Because it's good up there. <laughs> Do it ahead of her, Scott. There you go. Bend your knees. Hoo hoo hoo! <laughs> Go get it! Oh yeah. This is making life easier. I have an assistant coach. His name's Scotty James. <laughs> Every time you teach, you learn. Every time you learn, you have the ability to teach. <laughs> we don't snowboarding, we do the best of it. Very, very quick. This is exactly some natural selection. Sean wrote it down on a napkin, but didn't really need to do that because that's yeah. what the uh, Four telephone devices are for. But joy. This is Jackson Hole. We got some good names on here. Are they going for the best time? <laughs> what? Yeah, no, I feel really good. I just, um, yeah, like last year when we typically would add a spring to learn some new tricks and stuff, I just missed out on that time. So I'm just making up for it now. But I mean, actually, actually competing and riding, I feel really good. So. Hey, tell her when she's doing her like initiating when you're telling her she's doing it like this on the deck. So that's how she's gonna do it in the pipe. Like, make her squat. So let it come to you and go with what feels good and, and do the flow. That was perfect. Yeah, that was way better. But you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. No, I just, I mean, as you said, five years, I come up here, grind it out, which I want to do, which I just feel a little bit like I want to do. 
but I'm just like, I'm just doing it with the same stuff that I already know. And yeah. I'm not, I don't want to sound like I'm being a b and making excuses, but I'm very motivated, but then this, I, I'm like demotivated because I'm like... It's the same thing. It's just the same shit. Next couple of days, I really want you to decide how much you can work with this pipe. We might be uh, making some other decisions. I think world champs are going to be here. On the road again. On the road again. Yeah, we're heading to Park City. Going to go check it out there. Um, as you can see, we're packing. I'm going to grab one more step. Okay, we've accumulated a lot of stuff over the past kind of month and a half on the road, which is why we have so many bags. Is this the final run of the inaugural natural selection first stop? Ben Ferguson. He went to go front seven. Combo platter off the top was strong. Cab underflip to front side five. The textbook Ben Fer method. What's going on with this weather? So the dog can communicate with the human. Yes. Oh, f how did I miss that one? What on earth are you doing? Getting some ventilation in the feet. It's nice to feel, feel naked without my boot on the chair. You ever take your boots off? Um, at home. On the chair on the ground. You wait till you get home and take your boots off? Mm -hmm. And then I let the dogs bark. And then he does like a 12 foot out switchback twist. Who's that? Taylor Gold. Let me see. What's that? Bow, what are you doing in the sink? Are coming down to ground level with the, the two idiots in the garage, you know? Dude, I'm absolutely stoked, honestly. I always watched him and it looks like a lot of fun, so. Yeah, I was stoked when you said you did. I actually gotta grab the charger for the GoPro angle. Okay, here we go again. We are back in the booth for another episode of The Bomble. When you guys, there's a bunch of competitors there, and you're not necessarily there to be friends. Now, like, what's the vibe between. So just let's be real. Let's get into some shit. Like, what's the vibe between the other guys at the pipe? Are you guys like, hey man, like, how's your weekend? Like, we're buds. Or are you kind of like, hey man? I'm, I'm, yeah, is it I'm small talk or are you vibing each other? What's the vibe up there? Uh. <laughs> All right, these ones done. Thank you. I appreciate that. Of course. I keep those for myself. <laughs> Watch. Watch. I think 
coming down and then up and then coming down and all your movements are very like just like just yeah. what they need to be no i've been like focusing on like doing nothing it's, i like it thank you i like it a lot there's the key folks do nothing seriously Honestly, it's been kind of funny after X Games. We kind of finished there and rode in Aspen for a bit, which was nice with Red Bull. And typically we would have just rolled into three or four more events, but this year being the year it is, uh, we pretty much had like a month away from competing. And then we start up again, beginning the 8th of March. So uh, been in limbo, but we've still been riding a lot, which has been super fun and that is pretty much all I got for you right now.